No time to sleep, Mario. We've got moons to collect. Yeah, hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. Let's see our new dialogue here. Eh, sure, why not? It sounds like a nice vacation. But oh, oh, there's a doggy. There's a doggy. There's gotta be a moon around here somewhere. Find it, boy. Oh, 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 oh. Smell something. You smell something. Oh, oh. You got it. You got it. Oh, oh man. He's zeroing in on it. It's around here somewhere. I feel some, he'll feel some rumbles, but I think that might be water splashes. Oh, 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 he's got it. Oh, he doesn't got it at all. Dang it. Oh, wait, 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 wait. He's got another one. He's got another one. Did you smell something or is it just me? I know I haven't showered, but still. Okay, we're going to take a look, see around here and maybe, oh, wait, 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 wait. Are you just hopping? Okay. So we just take a look, see around, maybe. Oh, 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 oh. Zeroing in. This might be something this time. This might be something this time. Oh, man. Man, you're just teasing me here. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Where? Are you Are you just going to keep teasing me or are we just get, where are we going to find the moon today? Oh, man. <laughs> I actually don't remember where the moon was around here, but it's somewhere. It's somewhere. Oh, I assure you. Well, there's a glowing spot. This is probably just Goombas. Yeah, of course it's Goombas. There's a lot of Goombas on this beach. <laughs> uh, micro Goombas, I should say. Oh, oh. I didn't mean to hit you, doggy. I thought you didn't seem to mind that much. Hmm. No, wait, 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 wait. wait. Oh, oh, I thought you were zeroing in on something. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe there's nothing right now at this moment in time. Oh, 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 maybe there is. Maybe there is. I just feel like I've spent a lot more time than is necessary for Doggy just because I forgot the location. Okay, there it is. I thought there was a moon around here. Found on the beach. Good dog. Good dog. Alright. So we are good to go here. Except that there's a hint art. Keep. Keep. Hmm. Hmm. Mysterious. Mysterious. So there must be something that has the word keep somewhere. You would think. You would think. Wait a second. How do you get up this shaft? I'm, I would probably need something that could shoot me upwards. Why, what could we possibly use to shoot upwards through a shaft? Oh, how about a gushing? That seems like a good idea. <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna try and get myself up there with as much water conserved as possible, if at all possible. Actually, isn't there a little pond there? Yeah, a little pond down there. Yeah, I was making a mountain out of a molehill here. Alright, let's see, and go around. Can I shoot at the... Yes, I can. I shoot at the Cat Mario there. And grab a boon. Ride the jet stream. Yeah. For, there's probably some way to get that. Like, with just regular moves. Knowing the creativity all that you could do with Mario's moves here. But I haven't really figured it out. I could be wrong, though, so... <laughs> uh, so there's another moon up there. You can take your gushing friend up through here and go up here. Beautiful on the cliff overlooking the beach, and there's also some Goombas with pirate hats on. <laughs> They're dressing for the occasion of being the baddies around the sea, but they are not very threatening. Yeah, now you got enough power moons. It's magical. <laughs> Actually, I probably shouldn't have killed that Goomba because we need to do a Goomba stack somewhere along the well. I'll, I'll be able to reset it anyway. Doggy, we're uh, we're done here. You took too long. <laughs> uh oh, uh oh. Feel the rumble. The treasure hidden in this room is so cunningly hidden. Your eyes will be of no use. You must feel the ground beneath you with exquisite care. Good luck, my friend. Mm. Feel it. Feel the rumble! I'm probably better off zigzagging. Oh, wait, wait, I felt something big here. Something big here! Well, that's, uh... Like, I guess that's sort of big. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait! Oh, oh, dang it! You guys! You guys! You're just messing up my rumble here. <laughs> okay, there's a moon! Yeah! Rumble on the seaside floor. 
What do you have to say about that? Oh, bravo. That took you a while there, because I think the in, in front text kind of was blocking things out from showing. But details. Details. Or maybe not. I don't know. All right. Clear. <laughs> Shall we? Is this Goomba stack for Goombet over on top of the... Uh, well, not on top of. It's through that path. Oh, I think we should. So, let's just keep going around the perimeter here and collect, collect, collect those Goombas. Yeah! A hat is a hat, so you don't have to worry about the pirate hats being like extra powerful hats or something like that. Don't you worry. Oh, wait. Oh, how do I get Goombas across this? Because won't they just like dissolve in the water? Yeah. <laughs> um, maybe there's enough Goombas on this side? <laughs> Hello? Hello? Yes! Okay, maybe, yeah, there, maybe there probably is enough Goombas on this side. Alright, let's stack these then. Sure, why not? And uh, needless to say, Goombas are not as fleet-footed as uh, Mario are, Mario is, so these spiky dikies here are probably a little bit on the more dangerous side for a Goomba, but they do seem to follow a certain pattern, like they seem to go along the same places every time, so just kind of watch their patterns and go where they are not, basically. So like, there's a nice safe spot here, we see, and there's a safe spot through here, and so she's like, oh, you're so brave, here's a moon for you, and then you get a moon, it's magical, and then we scare her away. <laughs> <laughs> Love by the seaside. So yeah, I guess you don't stack those uh, Goombas up on the cliffs. You go get <laughs> you get the ones over through here. And I think we're... Uh, I'll keep taking the Goombas along here. And see if I need them for anything. I don't remember if I do. I might. I might not. I don't, I don't think I did. I think I did this on my first play as well. That's why I, I'm... That's why I did this before, probably. <laughs> I was like, mm, maybe I should check it out, just to, just to be sure I don't miss anything as long as I have this Goomba stack, but nah, we're good. Um, there's also that ledge up there, which I need a gushin for. So we're gonna go ahead and pop all the Goombas there, hello. And we go. Go up. He oh, that's oh yeah, the height thing. Uh, and that means it's more of a puzzle here. Let's go up to this height here. Oh yeah, I'm scaring you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't worry. <laughs> Everything will be okay. Uh, now can I reach that from here? Maybe. Uh, no, I cannot. That is a tragedy. <laughs> But maybe not that much of a tragedy, because I think there's another higher higher place around here. Yeah, sorta. Let's start my gust from here. Yeah, there's seeds around these parts. Keep those in mind. Okay, here we go, here we go. Captain Toad's up there. <laughs> Man, he sure gets himself in places. Oh no, I ran out of water! <laughs> and I solved the puzzle! But yet. But yet. I didn't have enough water to complete the puzzle. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just try, trying to kind of get that there. Well, whatever. <laughs> just trying to get it to respawn somewhere around because it takes a lot longer to uh, get one that's on land and stranded back to the sea than it is to just wait for one to respawn. Alright, here we go. Let's try this again here. Refill here, I guess. And then land, I guess, on here? With a lot of water, go up and forward, I suppose, hopefully, with enough water remaining, and then we'll be able to maybe get it up to Captain Toad, right, right, right? Yeah, maybe not. Hmm, hmm. See, look how, look how slow I go. <laughs> okay, so that may not be the solution after all. Hmm, hmm. Can I take, like, a gushing along the whole low route and maybe use the little bits of water along the way to refill? I guess I could try that. If that's not... Because I thought I took the uh, other route to actually... Oh, I forgot, how did I forget about these? But yeah, I thought I uh, got it the other way when I came through here before. And... <laughs> 
Oh man, you're all oh, geez, all oh, geez, all oh, geez. I need water, water. Okay. <laughs> right, I'll try this again here. Yeah, go above everything, I suppose. Yeah, there was water along the way, right? 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 Yeah, there's that little pond. Maybe I'm just supposed to scuttle my way up there and then refill sparringly or something, like dodging it with an even slower critter? I don't quite remember. Hmm. 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 I guess I could try that. I mean, as long as I don't burn more water than I need to. I should say evaporate more water than I need to. Nah, it's more like shooting water, but yeah. Anyway, let's try this again. Unless, actually, hold on. Is there a way to get Captain Toad from that ledge there? Like, going from that ledge up to there and around? Hold on, that might be it. I, I could have swore I did it from the outside ledges. And not the... Oh, it was this way! Okay, so it wasn't the other way around. Oh. <laughs> Apparently you could be hurt by fire even inside the Gushin. It's good to know, okay. Don't be scared, it's just me! I'm gonna have to wait for that to despawn, aren't I? Alright, we're good. <laughs> I wanted to get a nice view of the seas! I climbed and climbed and got all the way up here! Made it too! So here, take this moon power moon I found! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> good job, Captain Toad, indeed. You are quite the mountain climber. Even I couldn't climb the wall here. I wonder how I get down. Well, that might be a problem. Take that fire. Take that. Alright, so let's go ahead and I guess continue along this route, like around the perimeter as I was going. And oh, wait, 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 actually, hold on. Before I get ahead of myself here, I should actually go to this corner. And actually, I want to get the dialogue here too, because remember I didn't get that before? The peculiar character can't be got at the top. I know, I know! <laughs> Commit every detail to memory. You should also probably get a photo. I mean, yeah, well, camera plus a photo because, well, well, photographic memory is not as uh, photographic as people think. Let's put it that way. <laughs> so what I want to do is come around this way because there's a bunch of stuff to see around the perimeter, uh, namely this right over here to start with. Eh. Yeah, I didn't really come down here by the mm, moon snake before, but there's also... I thought there's something on... Um, yeah, well, there's that, I guess, but... No, I wanted to do a cap turn. A cap... Oh, I can't because it's just going to get hooked on the middle of that. Well, okay, okay. And then there is also a hatch that you can go down for a timer challenge, if I recall correctly. Or, or maybe not so much a timer challenge as it is a moon shard challenge. I don't... I don't know if it's... Oh, it is open up to me right now. Very nice. Very nice. <laughs> so we go ahead and put our hat on here. So that means no fish for us going into the deep, dark, unknown. So go quickly. <laughs> There's bubbles and stuff like that along the way, but, you know, you still want to kind of be as quick as you possibly can for the sake of, you know, safety and whatnot. So there's that. There's everywhere else you see a bubble. There is a moon, except for the one in the center where there was a uh, like an unlimited bubble generator and whatnot. Oh wait, actually, a ground pound these. Yeah, I was gonna say I was gonna throw my hat at that, but I don't have a hat. Hearts also recover your air, as you see there. Anyway, just kind of dodge Unagi along my way here, just trying to get a snack, but not not trying hard enough, I say. <laughs> Yeah, last one, yeah, I think it's like in the middle somewhere high and or something, I don't know. We'll see, I got four. And a coin, I guess not all of them are moon shards like I thought. Huh? Let's just take a peek see here. Not like I have a choice. <laughs> oh, there it is. Yeah, I was like in the middle something. Oh no, this is... Yeah, this is actually on the outer rim. I don't think there's one in the middle. I don't know. Anyway, I got him fast enough this time that it's forgivable. <laughs> All right, purple. I'm coming for ya. You just stay there. I'll get you out of here, and we'll be good to go. Yeah, moon shards in the sea, and 
we shall leave everything be. Go, go, Mario, go. Go, go, Mario, go. Yeah, grab an air bubble before you leave this place. Just for the sake of safety. And touch the hats. Get it back on your head. And you are good to go once again. I might as well grab this too. This is on the lower route around the moon rocks. I mean, well, moon snakes, pardon me. And like, now I guess I'll go up and grab that seed, because I'm going to be going over to the area anyway, this part. So I might as well take this route and show you it in its entirety. It's not that much to see, mind you, but yeah, this is a different way of getting up here. What's this? I say, what is it? I say, what is this? It is a moon, that's what it is. The Back Canyon excavates! I, I guess this is technically called the Back Canyon? Sorta, kinda? M maybe, sorta? Possibly? Ish? Anyway, grab the seed and take it with you. We're gonna keep going along this route here until we reach the little cabana hut type place there, whatever, whatever you want to call it. Maybe it's a hotel for them, I don't know, but oh, no, no, don't you dare, don't you dare knock the seed out of my hands before I get this thing to where it's supposed to go. Oh, okay, so anyway, <laughs> we just continue along here, and I'm pretty sure I cleared this, yeah, because that's the hint art over there. Mm, I'll just kind of avoid you guys, there we go. Yes, beach volleyball is back, and that thing is really hard to do with one player. If you are looking for the beach house, it's just over there, so it's a beach house. Got it. I'm gonna grab this and take it up here. There's four spots for four seeds. Uh huh, a lot of exploration to be done in this place. Uh, if only I had some water, flowers to water and care for. How about this? Flowers need water to grow. So, <clears throat> to speed things along, I'll see at this checkpoint, what you could do is grab one of these bad boys we hit each other <laughs> take it on over here and give her a little water how's that sound we were not able to do this at other kingdoms by the way oh shoot I ran out I ran out no no refill okay. grab those purple coins there anyway and let's keep watering this one. Just keep watering until it blooms. Yep. How's that look? Looks pretty good to me. Let's grab that moon. Yeah, we can actually get these right away now in this place, unlike the other ones. It's incredible, isn't it? Just because you have a certain water jet friend. It's pretty nice. Oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. I think I actually need to take this around the, the perimeter anyway. Uh, well... Yes, I'm saving the underwater stuff for a little bit later. Uh, yeah, I think it's up through here is another one of those passageways. Yeah. Hello there, door. I'm going inside. Whether you like it or not. You may have bolted yourself, but not bolted yourself well enough. Down is death, so beware. And just refill at ponds. You know how the, these things work by now. And go. <laughs> I guess I could skip that section because I know there's another pond coming up shortly. There we go. But well, now, as things are looking a lot more dangerous, we've got poison, though it's not really much different than the bottomless pit, in all honesty. So don't be intimidated by the poison. We're off. I think I'm going to have enough water to pull this off. Oh, jeez! That was a little too close. Treasure chest in the narrow valley. And look down. Go all the way down here. And there's another moon. Yeah, that one that I got there, that was a secret moon. Can you believe it? <laughs> That's how I wanted to conserve my water until I got to that point as best I could after that last uh, water jet area. Fly through the narrow valley. That's the regular one. I don't think there was any purple coins there, but I said that before and I missed them before. So, <laughs> who knows? We'll see. Uh, nothing up there. I mean, there might be coins, but they're not, I mean, not like gold coins, but nothing really super, super special or anything like that. There's something hanging out up above here. What could that be? Oh, I, I can't go to the first person view here of all... Why? Why? <laughs> so yeah, it's purples. 
guess that we need is to get those purples. Wow, this is really bright. <laughs> hello, hello. I, I, I shook, I swear I shook. Okay. <laughs> Maybe I just wasn't close enough for it to do the homing thing. Man, this camera is giving me all sorts of ire on these parts. Okay. <laughs> Uh, I guess I can continue on around here. There is another ledge, I think, up way high that you can't access. Yeah, over there without a painting. But yeah, so don't don't worry about that. We're just we're just gonna leave that for now. And now you know I I, I really feel obligated to see what's up here. Just just to be sure I'm not missing anything. Ah, okay. <laughs> just to be sure. I think the last thing I'm going to do this part is head on over to this rocket we seen a little bit earlier and have a shot. Woo! What do we have? Uh oh. Uh oh. This does not look friendly. There's a lot of fog. You can clear the fog. <laughs> Using your hats, so I'll just look around very carefully. Throw it at those to get hints. Oh shoot! We've ruined everything! We've ruined everything! Nah, no, it's okay. It's just a demonstration, I guess you could say. Yoink. You notice that those uh, energy beam things also clear out the fog as well. So it's not actually unintentional that I hit that. But yet, you may not want to hit it, <laughs> depending on depending on where your position is. Let's put it that way. Oh, you jumped over the laser, you trooper! <laughs> uh, I think there's two moons here, actually. There's one like over in that area. I forgot how to get to that specific spot. Uh, I might have to do some fanciful jumps, for all I know. <laughs> anyway, I guess I can. Ooh. Ooh, I'm kind of losing my way here. This is scary. A little scarier than it needs to be. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, okay. This ledge... Oh, there we go. That's where... Okay. It's just a little, little teeny tiny ledge. And you get over here. And I think there is something down in the middle of this. I think. Aha! That's the secret moon. Sunken treasure in the cloud sea. Very good name for it, I have to say. I gotta find my way back somehow. The fog is really dense in this game, I gotta say. <laughs> fog has never disoriented me more in any other game but this one. <laughs> so it's, it's doing a pretty good job of being fog. And it looks like that is it, I think. Unless there's purples that I'm missing here, but I sure hope I'm not. Waiting in the cloud sea. I mean, could you imagine throwing your hat all around here for purple coins? And that would suck. <laughs> uh, can I get on top of this big old structure? Probably not, based on the height of that. Oh, sure, down is death when I go walking through there normally. If I take a rocket. <laughs> and it's not like Mario takes fall damage anyway. <laughs> And with that, I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next part when I continue exploring this area. There's a ton more to see, as you might have guessed. <laughs>